Oh, uh, so I am here at Jamie Sire. Hey. Uh, you may know her from the live Food Network app, but she's actually live IRL with me today. Uh, we are getting a Thai lunch at uh, Nude, Nude and Chill. Nude, Nudes Nude. and Chill. Nudes and Chill. Which is not what it sounds like. I mean, it's <laughs> sort of what it sounds like. Well, it like. is, yes. Kind not of. what you're thinking. Uh, but yeah, new Thai place here in Williamsburg, and it's, do you want it to go here because? Yeah, I mean, I think that we don't have a, a huge abundance of Thai food in Williamsburg. And the stuff that we do have, I think, is like the pretty standard pad thai, you know, that kind of thing. Here they have some of the more authentic dishes that I had when I visited Thailand three years ago, so that's why I'm super excited. All right, let's go inside. Uh, all right, so we just finished the meal. Um, what were the three dishes that we got? Um, so we got cow soy, which is this spicy yellow curry noodle dish um, that I had in Chiang Mai. I think that they definitely dumbed down the spice a little bit. Yeah. It wasn't as spicy as I remember, but it was still very, very flavorful. Uh, and you really like that And those one had too. like egg noodles Yes, in egg, it, egg, egg noodles. No, sorry. But egg noodles on top, like fried egg noodles on top. Yes. And egg noodles. And egg noodles underneath. Yeah. So it was a like nice little texture, and then they serve it with some pickled cabbage that you can kind of eat along with it. The other thing that I was super excited about, um, they call it pork knuckle here, but in Thailand I remembered it as. Um, let me see if I can say it right. Khao ka mu, okay. which is like basically like stewed pork leg. Um, with the Chinese five spice and uh, medium boiled egg and then some rice and they also serve that with some pickled cabbage. So mm. Really, really flavorful. That's good. And we got the popcorn chicken. Of course, because right. duh. <laughs> I mean, I, I think like, well, here's my problem. Okay. When I looked at the menu, I saw a couple of dishes that looked delicious, like these little toasts and all mm -hmm. these things that is not available during the week. The menu is confusing online and it's even more confusing walking because it's a giant sign that says brunch menu and had all the items I wanted, but they meant legitimately on the weekend brunch. So. A little disappointed with that. I think all the dishes were good. The texture's really nice, flavors are really good. Um, I mean, I definitely, it is up the street for me, so I will definitely be ordering in from here. Definitely. Um, if that's, whatever that means to you. Um, but yeah, pretty good. Yeah, I'm in. I mean, I, I like that we have some Northern Thailand dishes here in Williamsburg. 